Greetings, gentle viewers. We're the Bittersweet Gamers. I'm We Squared. And I'm the Opinionator. And guess what I got today? That's right! In honor of Billy finally getting his glasses, we present to you, Billy Vision! Ah, uh, that looks about right. But now, I can see everything! Or at least better than I could. Finally, we have control to do whatever we want. But we're not going to show all of that. We're just going to focus on the salient points. Because otherwise, this Let's Play will be 500 episodes long. And who wants to deal with that? Ain't nobody got time for 500 episodes of us checking vending machines for what they sell and junk like that. <laughs> what we are going to do is plan out every day that we've been doing in advance. And we'll just go through the interesting and fun stuff. Yeah. Because frankly... If we were stuck together for 500 episodes on a Let's Play, we would probably never speak to each other again when it was over. I mean, I already hate Billy, so right? it'd get even worse. It, you didn't have to say right. That, that was a <laughs> joke, you know. Oh, ikesugi Koo, you must be so tired. Don't worry, I'll be watching over you. <laughs> I'll post online, and everyone will know what me and ikesugi suit can share. <laughs> I'll tell him he seemed a bit tired, so I massage his shoulders for him. <laughs> Never talk like that again! Also, stalking is my job! <laughs> Lately, I get this weird feeling like someone's staring at me. Man, I hope it's not ghosts. Maybe you're just really tired. Don't go fainting on me all of a sudden, alright? Oh, are you talking about those psychotic breakdowns? It's nothing that crazy. Maybe I'm just tired or being stalked. I'm not sure I want to apply for a job in front of these guys. Yeah, I know what you mean, but we only got 23 yen. Mm. That's like 2.3 cents. <laughs> okay, so we got to get to work. Oh, well, what are our options? Okay, so the way it works is you have to have your stats at a certain point before you can do any of these. So all we can really do is a convenience store, and we really need money. Oh, like, a lot good. of it. Retail. Dude, I don't want to hear it. I freaking used to manage a convenience store. I'm so sick of convenience stores. I hate them so much. <laughs> I mean, just all the dang... That's a lot harder. It is a lot harder than people give it credit for. That's true. That's and true. at least if you work in a place that's got its okay. stuff together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay? Because the place I used to work, it was pretty professional. None of this sitting around, hanging around, looking at your phones. You had to be moving, like, all the time. <laughs> and typically, we didn't even have enough time in a given shift to get all the work done. And that's with moving really... Ah! Hi, this is 777 on Central Street. Calling about the job opening. Hold on, I'll get the manager. Thanks for waiting. So you wanted to apply for a part-time job? I guess. You're a student, right? I'll plan your schedule around the days you're available. In what world does retail work like this? <laughs> Man, I would have had an employee who was like, you know, I can like come into work today and stuff. What do you think about that? Well, what about tomorrow when we really need you? Sorry, I'll be doing school work. <laughs> I would have had to knife all these guys! Woo! I would have been the one doing everything in the first place! Ah! Oh God. Oh, oh, oh. I don't feel safe! Oh. I'm not bitter or anything! No, we're bittersweet! I think Damon needs some special medicine after that, like tranquilizers or something! <laughs> Shut up, Billy! <laughs> yeah. I'm scared! Anyway, the way it works is every so often during the day, whenever we feel like it, because that's how all of our jobs work, is we only work whenever we want to, right? Anyway, we can go and do that to make some money. Now is not that day, because we're hunting confidants. I should ask her about the enhancing drug I heard her talking about the other day. You know, I got an email oh. about that. I don't want to hear about any enhancing drug emails, okay? But if that if, if that's actually what she's going to offer me, it's going to be a strange confidant indeed. So, Miss Takemi, I want that rumored medicine. Huh? <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. You're the kid who was at LeBlanc. Regular medicine won't do the trick. You also have a cat in your bag. <laughs> very, very, uh, very clean. <laughs> I have my 
freezer. So hot. <sighs> Fine. Just head into the examination room for now. You're lucky I'm an unscrupulous back alley doctor. <laughs> oh. That medicine, huh? Oh no! What are you trying to do? So which conversation of mine did you eavesdrop on to hear that? Is she gonna shake us? It was obvious, actually. You call that hiding? <laughs> Ninja doctor! <laughs> Not that I care, of course. Well, I was gonna dispose of that medicine anyway. I got a little too carried away with it. What, did the last person you give it to suddenly gain twice his muscle mass and get superhuman powers? I don't know if you're talking about the Incredible Hulk or Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, but... <laughs> but tell me, why would a high schooler like yourself be so interested in that medicine? Woo! <laughs> it's very strange indeed. <laughs> you don't seem to be very athletic, so... What exactly are you up to? Ah, there isn't any way to be truthful, is there? Yes, there is! It's for brain power! Alright. Huh? Brain power? Oh, for your entrance exams? So, you're looking to improve your concentration and reduce fatigue. Oh, right. Hmm. That's not the best idea. But, if that's <laughs> what you want to do... I suppose I'll let you live. Take care. Then good luck with that. I have no obligation to help you with that. Why don't you have an energy drink or something? Oh. What no, do you think? No, dude, come on. Don't threaten her. I, <laughs> How are you supposed to have a confidant built on, like, threats and bullying? Well, actually, isn't that a better idea than just begging like I'm some sort of junkie from the street? Well, how is threatening to tell people make you any less desperate? It'll actually make the conversation more personal, that's for sure. Ah, well, you're the one in control. If you feel <laughs> that's the best option, I'll just be over here judging you. I'll tell people. You're really annoying, you know that? Huh. <sighs> The medicine is really expensive. And besides, didn't I hear you say you had something like 2.3 cents? <laughs> I don't think you can really afford it. And it's not something a high schooler can get his hands oh, on. Oh my god! It costs almost as much as a car. Got it. So, how about you just go home? Oh! Hey, 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 hey. Can I work for it? Interesting. What, like part time help? Do you consider yourself someone with a good amount of stamina. That's what all the ladies say. Mm. I admit I have been looking for a young person around your age to help me out. You're not going to experiment on me, are you? <laughs> but I haven't been able to find one even after putting an ad in the paper. <laughs> are you up for it? What would I be <laughs> doing exactly? <laughs> do you want to do it or not? Oh, You'll God. Be participating in clinical trials for my medicine. Hang on. I'll be right back. <laughs> so am I going to get a whole bunch of medicine and I don't even know what it's going to do and I just have to use it to find out and that's what's going to improve the, the What is lake? this, a roguelike? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's right. This has become that hack. Here you go. Worried about the side effects, huh? Well, you can relax. Rest assured, my autopsy <laughs> is guaranteed to find out exactly what part of it killed you. Did you change your mind? What, aren't you gonna take it? The exit's right there if you wanna leave. This is the weirdest sort of social link beginning I've ever seen. I don't think it's actually a, co a coincidence that a police car just passed outside the house. <laughs> I don't drink this, Takemi probably won't sell me your medicine. Well, go on. You know, I was really expecting this to be more of a social thing. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh well! Bottoms up! I don't think that's how medicine works. Huh? I, I can't believe you actually drank it. I was trying to scare you off. It's a suppository. No, I'm just kidding. Bitter. Yet sour. It's beyond description. It was the most delicious thing I've ever tasted in my life! <laughs> ah, I can deal with it. Wow. Still doing okay, huh? Ooh, 
Not bad for a high school. Like a third arm sprouts. <laughs> uh. <gasps> <laughs> well, game over, I guess. Did we fail? <laughs> Is this like that BS thing in the beginning? <laughs> hey, now that I'm like poisoned and dying on the, on the bed, are we going to, you know, have a nice long chat and get to know each other? Do you remember anything from the moment you took the medicine until now? Hmm. By the look in your eyes, I'd say you don't. Medicine? What medicine? What am I doing here? I just started school today. <laughs> <laughs> ribbit! 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 You briefly woke from your coma, but you were completely dazed during the entire examination. What are you doing with this stuff? <laughs> you eventually lost consciousness and fell back asleep. It's now two weeks. You've been expelled. <laughs> are you out of your mind? Only an idiot would have drank that. You gave it to me! I like how it's like, I'm not out of my mind, spoken in a poor, poor grammar. <laughs> I'm not out of my mind. <laughs> Fine. And by the way, the reason you lost consciousness was because of the taste. I kind of want to try something that tastes so extreme that it makes you pass out. I don't. It produces a foul smell and it mixes with gastric juices, similar to Sir Streming. What the, know, whatever the heck is. that is. Yeah. <laughs> oh well. All that matters is that thanks to you, I was able to get some good data. Okay, it's my turn to make good on my part of the deal. That's why I waited until you woke up. So that means you're gonna give me something that's worth enough to buy a car, right? <laughs> I don't want the general public to know about my original medicines. So you're strictly prohibited from disclosing what happens here to anyone. Understood? Oh my. <laughs> Same goes for you, lady. Duh. Then it's a deal. As long as you come here for it, I'll give you the medicine at a good price whenever you want. I may even add additional selections in time. I look forward to your continued patronage. Is that what they call it? <laughs> All right. Yep, here it is. Wow, it, you actually get... Like a, a flash forward scene. This happened every other time we formed a confidant. Right? I just thought with the optional ones. Well, no, she's gonna tell us about the kind of. Considering all the yeah. actions you've taken, you oh, must have I had see. someone with medical expertise. She's interrogating us about our crew. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, you're right. Who? And how did you treat your wounds? Magic. It'll be easy to find out who if we look into this, you know. That's interesting that it seems like it, that uh, she's actually implicating all of your confidants yeah. as as part of the Phantom Thieves. Well, kind of. Like suppliers? With the birth of the oh, death, death. Arena, I have obtained the winds of the Yes, I should definitely get medicine power. from the Death Arcana. <laughs> I'm scared, David. So... When can you come back for the next clinical trial? You tell me. I have to follow the icon, after all. <laughs> oh. How meta. You don't remember that part, either? <laughs> well, I was saying that teenage test subjects are quite valuable in the medical research industry. After all, they're not legally allowed to sign contracts, so this whole thing is entirely under the table, but the data is incredibly valuable, so thanks for breaking the law. But then again, I am, too, so who am I to judge? We're all breaking the law, Jesus! So I'll provide you the medicine for your entrance exams, and in exchange, you'll be my guinea pig. I'll do anything for drugs! <laughs> I have to perfect this medicine. Winners don't do drugs, kids. If you're able to move now, you can go home. All right. Take care. Bye. Uh, yeah, are you my mommy? <laughs> <laughs> Guts up! Hey. You better not be up to any trouble. Like, you look like you're stoned or something, kid. Don't even ask today, okay, sir? You just make one mistake and your life's over. Oh, you thought it was going away? No, we're just gonna put it there permanently now. <sighs> if you have nothing to do, let's clean up this room. An uncluttered room is an uncluttered mind. Besides, I really want to be able to do things in my room in the evening. <laughs> so that seems to mean I probably have to start by cleaning everything up. That would make sense. 
probably the shelf with old books first. Yeah, you're probably right. Between that and the junk littered floor, definitely it would be better to work on the on the place where I can actually study and read. Maybe oh. clean up that fan. <laughs> Let's clean this up. That's incredible. Politics, law, and philosophy. These all sound like some pretty difficult books. By the way, that sounds really good to me. <laughs> oh, maybe you'd be able to read this one. <laughs> Yoncha Wanderer, eh? What did you do with them all? I wonder why this one's mixed in with all these difficult books. I mean, you would know. It's your books. <laughs> oh, well, whatever. Okay. Wouldn't that be Sojiro's books? Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, he... All my stuff is in the box. Yeah, you, you don't own much, Hopper. <sighs> well, this is a good opportunity. The floor over there is looking pretty messy, too. Let's just clean up everything up while we're at it. Yes! Okay, I guess it doesn't matter, then. Oh! Oh, look, that plant is still alive. We can decorate with it. Yeah, we were seeing in the stores that there's a bunch of different types nice. of plant food. Yeah, so I yeah. I guess this way we can actually, you know, grow a house plant. You know Excellent. what? As it turns out, I actually have two house plants. I like house plants. I want to read books about politics, law, and philosophy, and I like house plants. If it weren't for me playing video games, I would clearly be an uncool loser. No, man. Don't, don't think like that. I don't. I assure you. Okay, uh, okay, just making sure. Even a dreary room can be brightened up with a little green foliage. Let's take good care of this plant so it won't dry up and wither away. Maybe, over oh. the course of the game, we'll randomly get rewards from it. What, what's it gonna do? Like, grow some medicine? <laughs> Let's get started. Hi there, everyone. I'm Mr. Hiruta, your biology teacher. You must all be shocked by what happened with Suzui-san. It was a shock to me, too. What's shocking is your bizarro voice there, sir. Can't you see this, this dramatic thingy around my neck? Clearly I'm some kind of fop. Uh, I think they call that a cravat, sir. I'll cravat you, son. Okay, sir. Although, I can relate to how she felt. I feel like jumping off ledges all of the time. Her eyes were devoid of life as they looked upon this sad, hopeless world. Sir? Well, I suppose everyone views the world differently. Let's have a test. <laughs> what the? <laughs> <laughs> Try to answer you this. You there. Take a look at this diagram. What, what class is this? I thought this was biology. What does this have to do with biology? Is the line extending from A connected to B or C? Which is it? Huh. It's an optical illusion, clearly. Yeah, you can tell what the... Okay, we're gonna think. All right, using the highly scientific power of drawing a line on the television with my finger, we have determined <laughs> that the correct answer is C. Yes. This is it. You do know. Correct. <laughs> Leave the fruity laughter to me. Yes, sir. It seems your eyes see the truth. Well, I think that was my finger, actually. You saw your finger with your eyes, yes? Fair enough, sir. This is an optical illusion. Some people see it correctly, and some do not. Isn't it strange that they view the same image differently? Yeah, I've never really been able to kind of think about how that works, but I mean, I'm not really uh, an ophthalmologist? I guess this technically is kind of a, a biology question? I, I suppose it turned out to be one. It yeah. looked like they were trying to do some sort of weird math first, but... Humans don't see the world as it is. We simply process visual information with our brain. How you see the world is nothing more than a trick of the mind. It is all mere cognition. That seems like an important word. Where have I heard that before? <laughs> there is no proof that the world each of us sees is the same. Hey, where are you right now? I, I just got out of class. I'm still in school too. I'm by the staircase outside your classroom, watching you. Think we should head into the palace today? Maybe? Hey, I thought of something the other day when we were running around the palace. Maybe it's because I haven't been moving around as much lately, but I feel like I'm getting weak. We're probably going to run into some pretty tough shadows sometimes. We should try to get stronger too. What, is that an invitation to go hang out? Sounds good to me. It's sunny outside. Perfect for training. So, you want to get your blood pumping? Let's do it. What are we doing, a 5K? Yeah. <laughs> 
Seems like even beauty has a lot on his mind. It's true that training your body will let you be able to move when it counts. Ta-da! Yes, yes, hang out with friends. Yo, I'm over here with the big floaty thing above my head over here. Yeah, what is that, man? That's pretty weird. I don't know, it just popped up. So you want to hang out? You think anybody else can see that? Eh, probably not. No one else can hear Mona Mona talk either. You know, there's this person over here that's got some floaty things. You know, I think that means I can talk to them or something. What are you talking about? I don't see nothing. Yeah, all right. Come on, man. Let's go hang out. Awesome. Yo. What's up, Jiro? You got any big plans for today? Well, I mean, I was thinking about going to the castle, but let's hang out. I realized that when we were running through that palace that I can't really move like I used to on account of my leg getting broke. Besides, you also didn't texted me this exact same thing. So how about we do some training? I can't just sit on my ass here. Sweet! Let's go work up a sweat behind the gym then. Don't take that too far out of context. Okay. <laughs> By the way, I appreciate that in this game you actually run around more and go to these places because in Persona 4, just... Hey, it's lunchtime, and then a procession of, like, 14 people would just walk up to you. Hey, do you want to hang out? Hey, do you want to hang out? Hey, do you want to go to the palace? Hey, do you want to hang out? Yeah, yeah. I feel like this is getting really stupid. Can I get gone? Go get changed. Well, I'm going to go take a walk while you're busy with him. Let me know when you're ready to leave. All right, Mona Mona, don't get caught by the teachers. Hmm. Man, this place brings back memories. This is my secret training spot. Er, uh, was. That is really sad, and I'm sure something interesting is about to happen, but I have to say first, what did you do? Just run in circles for practice? Because you can't, like, run real far, and there's no obstacles. I, uh... That's why it was a secret. Only, shut up. <laughs> only you would think about training for track here. Come on, bro, man. Why you gotta bust my chops like that? Yeah, you're right. You were really good, I'm sure. Back when I was on the track team. Actually, I've been thinking about trying to run again. In all, that's nice. Yeah, in all seriousness, he really should. I bet he could. The problem was Kamoshida. Yeah. Fighting in that other world was a total shock. I couldn't move like I used to. It just felt... lame. <laughs> no, that was pretty serious, though. I know, but lame can't move with this... this never mind. Oh, I feel so foolish. <laughs> so I started thinking, maybe I need to build up my muscles again. Anything's got to be better than this flimsy body, right? Only you would say that, that your body is flimsy. Plus, maybe then I'll be able to help out a little more. You seem pretty excited. Yeah! Hell <laughs> yeah, I'm looking forward to this. Anyways, you act like it's only me who's going to be doing this. Well, you're getting in on it too. May as well. You know, for a long time, I personally was really physically inactive, mm -hmm. kind of a schlub. Mm -hmm. But like recently, I've spent a lot of time at the gym and I'm actually getting in pretty good shape. So he's absolutely right. That's right. For anybody who happens to wa be watching this that's that's like lazy, don't do that. Yeah. It, it's not worth it. Ever since I've been biking to work, I've l actually lost some weight. Yeah, and I mean, you're in way better physical shape oh, than you yeah, ever were yeah. too. It's like, it really does feel good. Come on, man. Whoa, don't look so surprised. Why'd you think I had you go and change into that? I love the look on his face <laughs> for this. It'd be pointless if I was the only one getting super fast, right? All right, I'm gonna do some knee-lift sprints. You're stuck with the normal ones. Well, you know what you're doing after all. I ran around the school with Muji. <laughs> well, he's the one who just beat himself to death. I was just running. Damn, my legs are all tight. Before Kamoshida came along, the track team was the biggest thing this school had going for it. Oh, I see. So Kamoshida even wrecked a good team. Oh, yeah, because only his could stand above them. <sighs> but it all changed after he got our coach fired and took over as the sub. Damn it. That bastard. Right from the very start, he was trying to get rid of us. I mean, the thing is, is he's actually a good athlete and a skilled coach who can produce results. You know, so he could have, mm -hmm. if he wouldn't have been such a bleepity bleepity bleep bleep bleepity bleep 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 bleepity bleep bleep. Oh my, you can't say those things on YouTube, David. <laughs> he could have actually been a really good coach for the track team and then had the volleyball and the track team. Yeah. But no. But no. He'd give us crazy workouts. Then when we couldn't do them, he'd add even more on top of that. You know, 
he's taking normal kids and putting them in at a national level type of performance with volleyball. Uh, if he didn't, yeah. if he didn't do the things he did, he clearly would be a great coach. Well, that's like saying if Charles Manson didn't eat people, he'd be a decent person. That's. A much less <laughs> evidence-based argument, though I will say the level of decency that one has does increase dramatically when you cease consuming other human beings. Day after day was nothing but that bullshit. He was going after me especially. Because he was the star of the team. Maybe. He knew. He knew I was the kind of guy who'd fight back. Ah, that's it. <clears throat> if my time dropped even a little, he'd cuss me out. Then on top of that, he brought up my parents. <laughs> Not my parents! <laughs> what about them? <sighs> Truth is, my mom's the only one I got. Yeah, poor guy. All my dad did when he was still around with drink. Sometimes he'd even beat me, or my mom. Man. I don't know how that bastard Kamoshida found out, but he told the whole goddamn team. Jeez. I mean, we can't be surprised anymore. I can't even get angry at him anymore. It's it's like the, it's already maxed out. The anger out. has hit the peak, yes. There's nothing else to say. And as you can guess, I lost it and hit him. It was like he wanted me to do it, though. He called it an act of violence and shut the team down. Thanks to that, the other guys on the team treat me like some kind of traitor. Man, when you see the coach, like specifically going after you and not in that type of motivating positive way how can you uh, anyway and they ain't wrong because of me they all lost their shot at the championship it's not really his fault though do you regret it a little bit yes and a little bit no Come on, don't ask me tough questions like that. I'm not very smart, you know. You gotta get further in the social link before I'll open up to you and tell you the really juicy details. Okay, fair enough, dude. <laughs> Anyways, it doesn't matter now. That's all in the past. I'm only thinking about the future now. That's what we're gonna do. Build the future by committing theft. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta think positive thoughts, brother. <laughs> yeah. High five! <laughs> yeah! That's awesome. That was nice. Okay, now he's got Baton Pass, and I guess once we get into the castle, we'll see what that really does. Because An already has it at level one. All right. Come on, we're all warmed up, right? How about another run? That's always when you get the best exercise. By the way, you're actually pretty good at running. What, do you think I was just going to complain about everything anybody ever wanted me to do? Not as good as me, though. Dude, you, you're <laughs> a track athlete. <laughs> Holy crap, my legs are shaking. Don't collapse on your way home, man. You're oh, pushing yourself yeah. way harder than me. Later. Hey. Just because you seem to be taking school seriously doesn't mean I'm not keeping an eye on you, got it? I'll know what's what as soon as I see your grades. You know, that's not as much of a threat as it has been in the past. <laughs> Want to prove you're turning over a new leaf? Make studying a habit as second nature is breathing. I was kind of planning on it. Nope, nope, I have to tell you that in a vaguely hostile manner. Yes, sir. Mm. This room looks so desolate since there's nothing in here. I've got a good idea. Bring me that chair, the one in the corner. Huh, what do you what do you want me to do? We're not gonna hang ourselves, are we? <laughs> this isn't Persona 3. You can reach that beam on the ceiling if you stand on this chair, right? It looks dirty! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah? Alright, let's train your body using that ceiling oh, beam. Oh, okay. Huh. I'll be leaving you in charge, but you'll need to train your body too. I'm gonna whip you into shape, so you better be prepared. <laughs> what a bossy cat. Huh, let's see what this does. So we can do pull-ups on a ceiling beam, and that improves your max hit points by five every time you do it. That's actually really cool, isn't it? Yeah, there wasn't anything like that in the previous one. I guess this way on a new game plus, when all your stats are maxed, you'll still have something to do that'll be valuable. But I think my time is probably going to be better spent studying. I just had a mental image of Jiro all buffed out like, Hello, my name is Jiro and I will pump you up. Ah, uh, that's probably not going to happen. Although, I, if I guess I did that ten times. <laughs> right, study! Now listen up. I like studying, okay? <laughs> 
I don't really understand, like, this cultural Japanese studying thing. I don't mean why they do it or why it's treated in, like, the language the way it is. Uh-huh. But I mean what they're actually doing. I don't really understand that. It, I guess in my case, the air quotes here, studying, has always been, like, reading books. I've never really had to study in school. I just grasped everything so quickly. Oh, right. But, I mean, in my case, mm-hmm. you know, I've got a bachelor's. Oh, right, right. You yeah, went to college. And it, was, <laughs> and, it was, and, it, and it was, like, at a university level. I'm, I'm not trying... I'm not trying to, like, make myself sound like I am perfect in every way or some, some dumbass crap like that. But what I mean is I did have to work pretty darn hard for yeah. my useless degree that I enjoy that's totally useless. <laughs> and so it was just a lot of reading. So it's like I don't really get what they're doing, like writing things down, like solving math problems, uh, doing I, English by rote. Well, generally, as far as I understand, you read the book and then you write down the important parts of the book so you could focus on the important parts of the book. What are your thoughts? I mean, I suppose that's actually, you know, a way to do it, but that just seems like it wouldn't be useful for me. But everybody studies in a different way, I guess. I'm sure that nobody really wanted to hear all of that, but alas, you did. So there. (laughs)